Welcome to this week's grocery haul. So we ended up going to Whole Foods and to Trader Joe's. So I put everything out and I will explain like what we got at Whole Foods, what we got at Trader Joe's, all of that. So we didn't really get a ton of stuff because we're not gonna be here for most of the week. We're actually going out of town, so that's exciting. But we stocked up on some snacks and freezer stuff and there's stuff that like we may not use this week, but we knew like we would have stuff when we got back from vacation. So a lot of it is stuff that once we get back, because we'll be getting back late, like on Tuesday night, we will have food for the next day so we don't have to like get home and then turn back around and go to the grocery store. We can wait until Wednesday night. So yeah, anyway, I'm just going to hop right in. I'm so excited because we've got a few new things to try and I'm... I'm so excited, so here we go. All right guys, so here is the overview of this week's grocery haul. I apologize if you can hear our neighbors like sawing something outside, so if you hear that noise, please just ignore it, just, you know, neighbor stuff. So anyway, let's hop right in. Like I said, we went to Trader Joe's and Whole Foods, so I'm gonna try to do Trader Joe's first and then get into our Whole Foods stuff. So first up, we have these organic beef hot dogs from Applegate, they are Whole30. I pick these up just for a quick lunch. I could just have hot dogs and like chips or something. And so these are really good. We got some ground chicken. James wants to make some sort of like ground chicken situation for his lunch this week. And then we also got just some regular chicken thighs for chicken, obviously. Then we have some bell peppers for James's ground chicken thing that he's gonna be making. We got two packages of Brussels sprouts because we're gonna do the Kung Pao Brussels sprout with the chicken thighs. Baby spinach because I felt like we needed to add something to our smoothies because they're all fruit and I just feel like we need to have a little balance. So got some baby spinach. We got some of these bananas for our smoothies. You guys know if you've been around for the past couple weeks, we do a lot of smoothies. I also picked up this sparkling apple cider vinegar drink. If I can get it to focus, there we go. Um, I really just saw this and thought, hey, I wanna try that, sounds interesting. So that's what we're gonna do, try that. I got this, um, I heard that this was new in the store, I saw it and it has like all the clean, healthy ingredients that I'm looking for. And I figured we could just pair this with like a, cassava flour or almond flour tortilla. I think I have some of those in the freezer, so this is just a good quick meal. We of course got two packages of the cauliflower gnocchi. This is great to just have if you are in a hurry but need something. Um, these are great to just have on hand. We've got a couple of these cauliflower rice packages, some strawberries, mangoes, blueberries, acai, and pineapple, all for our smoothies. Got some more of these chomp sticks. These are just a great snack to have on hand. Some more of these apple rings. I'm gonna try this watermelon jerky. It looked interesting, so I figured why not. This week I just got one of the applesauce packets because I still have some, but I'm just gonna kind of like, um, what am I trying to say? Restock my stash a little bit. We got two of these dark chocolate honey mints. So good, put them in the freezer, so amazing. Some dried pineapple slices. I'm very excited about this. It does not fit my healthy lifestyle, but I've heard so many good things about these and they're limited edition, so I was like, you know what? Gotta try it. We got another box of Spindrift. This stuff was really good, so I wanted to get another box of that. We got two of these um, things of apple juice. We use them in our smoothies. So I believe that's everything we got at Trader Joe's. So let's move into the Whole Foods part of this. So starting off, we got this cassava spaghetti. So we really like this when we want spaghetti. And I just found that getting like this, like paleo friendly spaghetti, 
um, I don't feel sick after eating spaghetti and it, it's really good. So if you struggle with eating spaghetti and you always like feel sick after eating pasta, I definitely recommend trying this and seeing if maybe that helps you not feel sick afterwards. All right, so I actually got two of these. I'm not sure where the other one is at the moment, but they're the epic chicken sriracha bars. These are really good, and we are gonna be in the car a lot, so I was trying to pick up like car snacks that are still healthy, but kind of fun road trip snacks. So I've got two of these um, Chipotle barbecue Siete potato chips. You guys saw this in last week's haul. I love these things. I could seriously eat the whole bag in one sitting. It's, it's ridiculous. Also got the salt, sea salt and vinegar ones. James got this matcha green tea. He likes to put that in smoothies also. And then the last two things we have are these paleo puffs. They're the fiery hot ones. And then these sun poppers, sour cream and onion. These are also paleo. So I figured we'd give those a try. So yeah, that is everything for our groceries this week. And plus another one of these, which I don't know where it is at the moment. All right guys, so that wraps up this week's healthy grocery haul. I hope you enjoyed it. Let me know in the comments below if you did, if you liked it, if you like the style of it. Let me know all that in the comments below. Don't forget to subscribe if you wanna see more Trader Joe's haul. Thank you guys so much if you've already subscribed. We are at, currently we are at eight subscribers and that is so exciting to me. So thank you guys so much for the support. But that is it for today's video and I will see you guys in my next one. Bye guys.